A German prisoner has been identified as a new suspect in the disappearance of Madeleine McCann from a holiday resort in Portugal 13 years ago. The man in his 40s is a convicted sex offender who had been living in the Algarve at the time, travelling around in a camper van. Tonight, detectives in Germany made a television appeal for more information. Madeleine McCann was three years old when she went missing from Praia de Luz in 2007. Here's our Home Affairs correspondent, Daniel Sanford. This is the Volkswagen camper van that was used by the new suspect in the Madeleine McCann investigation. With its distinctive colours, police hope it will trigger someone's memory and lead to new evidence about their as yet unnamed suspect. He used the vehicle to live in and certainly the week preceding um, he was in there living. Um, so he would, dart, he would uh, move around the area using that van as probably his base. The suspect also used this Jaguar car at the time. He registered the car into someone else's name the day after Madeleine McCann disappeared. The three-year-old went missing on May the 3rd, 2007. She'd been sleeping in her parents' holiday apartment while they were 50 metres away having a meal with friends. Her 17th birthday was last month. On the German version of Crime Watch this evening, police there revealed that the suspect has previous convictions for sexually assaulting girls and is thought to have burgled hotels and holiday apartments. He's currently in prison in Germany. His phone was used in Praia de Luge about an hour before Madeleine McCann disappeared. Tonight, the Metropolitan Police are asking for anyone who can help with information about the mobile number he took the call on that night, the VW camper van that he was using that summer, and the old Jaguar XJR6 that he registered out of his name the day after Madeleine McCann disappeared. In a statement, her parents, Kate and Jerry McCann, seen here in 2007, said they'd like to thank the police forces involved in Britain, Germany and Portugal. They said they'd never give up hope of finding Madeleine alive. The German police said that theirs is a murder investigation, but Madeleine McCann's parents said that whatever the outcome is, they need to know what happened as they need to find peace. And Daniel is with me now. This is such a long-running mystery. How significant do you think this development could be? Oh, I think it is a really good big moment, 13 months on. You've got three police forces in Germany, Britain and Portugal all agreeing that this man is a key suspect. And he, he's a, a person that was living in the area at the time, whose mobile phone was being used in the town that evening, uh, a man whose car was then registered out of his name into someone else's name. He then left the country soon afterwards. The Metropolitan Police describing this as a significant moment. Frankly, I think it's the biggest breakthrough that has been in this case uh, since the case began. And of course, importantly, the man is in prison in Germany already, so he doesn't have to be hunted down. There could still be bumps in the road. Sometimes evidence that seems certain becomes less certain. But I think at the moment, this looks really, really significant. Daniel Sanford, thank you.